guys, welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. So we're here at PetSmart. We're going to buy stuff for the blizzard. Hot day. Okay, we're gonna get um, crickets. Um, let's get the small and medium. Can you see the date? We're buying live crickets and a mealworm. What's the date? June 9th? Oh no, don't. Oh no. What is today? 18. So it's like. So this is where they keep their uh, mealworms. They put it in this uh, little refrigerator. Refrigerator. Because it has to be refrigerated. The mealworm to stunt. Um, what was the reason why they um, put in the refrigerator? To slow the growth process. Oh yeah, to, so, to slow their growth process. Like to just eat them. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna get this last because we're gonna go get um I'm gonna go stay at the fish. I'm gonna go get them another hide hiding spot. Ruben, go get one of this. Go get another one hiding spot. That one. Yeah, we'll take that one. Shoot, yeah, get the better one. Oh yeah, that one because it's a lot wider, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go over here. We're gonna get um look at the cat. Um, I'm going to get a mat. This seems like really real. It's probably because it is. Okay, baby. Can you move a little too? I'm gonna get a heating mat. I don't know where their heating pad is. Oh yeah, it's over here. OMG, they're so expensive. They're like 26 to 50 something dollars. Alright, now I'm gonna get my like the geckos. These are for like the uh, the tropical ones. They're, they are so nice. Like this is the stuff you put in the aquarium for the reptiles. Look at this. This is so big. It's like $34.99. Um, so we're buying um, our lizard. One of this hide. Um, what is it called? A wood hide? what they call that so we're gonna get one for them and then I'm gonna get um, something else yeah they're gonna like this Ruben so they're gonna have two hides I feel like I want to get them a wood oh no not a wood chip So we just got home from from Ross. We went to Ross and um, we went to Pitsco. So I just spent forty four dollar and sixty cents um, from uh, from PetSmart right there. So I bought this. Hide a wood hide is like um, it's like a log that they can hide under here. 
because they like to hide and it's um it's from a world thrive of wonder right there well this is really nice it's not a real wood it's like imitation wood it looks like a log it's like a real wood and i got them another mealworm and i got them crickets so there's a there's a bunch of crickets in there and the most important thing that i needed for them is this heating um heating pad or um, heat mat so we're gonna put it in their tank right now and we will see if they like it they need to have it guys look at this they're literally on the top of each other Lexi is on the top of Gary hey Gary won't care Hi, buddy. Hi, buddy. What you doing? Why are you on the top of Gary? Huh? Why are you on the top of Gary? All right, so I'm just showing how to install the heating mat. So first, this is the package for the heating mat. And it's meant for a reptile. Um, like leopard geckos and whatever is on the picture here so first thing you will need to clean the bottom of the tank so i uh, sprayed it with alcohol i have alcohol right here and then wipe it with um a paper towel and then i peel off this part um from the from the mat and then stick the mat in there make sure there's no air bubbles or anything make sure you press it really good so so it's stick there and then the other side is the plug and that plug is gonna go to the extension cord since the the outlet is not close to the to the wall so yeah we will see and also it came with this um, supposed to be like a little stand to put in the corner but uh, with our terrarium we don't need it because it is already elevated like there's already like a stand this one is so it is already elevated so there's no sense of putting that here because it's not gonna work for for our terrarium since it is already built has um stand built in when we purchased it so i'm gonna flip it and i'm gonna uh, assemble their terrarium all right so this is the arrangement of their tank right now so they are hiding right here and this is the new hideout that i bought it looks like a log it's right there so they have like big space for them to go in there so they already eat breakfast they eat crickets and also there is a mealworm in here and their waters right there so they are a happy lizard they are very very spoiled though mama spent a lot of money already for them to make their house and for them to live comfortably comfortable so yes you can't see them right now because they're hiding yeah they're over there all right guys so today um it's kind of busy day um i did a lot of chores to do um before i go to work at 3 30 today so I decided to uh, to get some groceries after we went to PetSmart. So I'm making a refreshment. So I shredded um, melon. Uh, here in the U.S. we call it cantaloupe melon. So I put ice cubes 
and I put uh, two cans of evaporated milk and one can of uh, condensed condensed milk and this is what it looks like it's really hot right now it's supposed to go to 97 degree here in Oklahoma City so I did not use all of the cantaloupe because I don't know if my kids gonna like it so most I pr most of the time I probably most of the time I ended up eating what I'm making especially like if they're like Filipino type of dessert so I'm just mixing it to make sure that the condensed milk is mixed with the condensed uh, the ibap and condensed mix all together so yeah it's been a long long time since since I made something like this so this is good for like mango also but I don't have access to the mango so cantaloupe is easier because it's just at the grocery store so in order for me to make like the mango the, the mango in the Philippines I have to go to the Asian market so yeah I'm gonna try it and I have a Okay. And then the rest, I'm going to leave it in the refrigerator. <laughs> 